The last year has been the most difficult for me because I've never had as many conversations about discrimination in my entire life. Um, next year, I think I'm looking forward to people being more um, uncomfortable, yet comfortable having those conversations. There have just been a lot of things going on like all over the country, and so everything, all these conversations are, you know, like right there in all of our faces that are unavoidable. And I guess growing up, I was kind of used to being sheltered to some of those conversations, but just because it was something new, which I think it may have been new to a lot of people. So just kind of embracing that, learning from that, and trying to find ways to grow from that. Well, uh, the biggest challenge we saw was making sure that we could continue to help our healthcare providers provide care and making sure that we have, were able to either help them get the products they needed or made sure that we were able to facilitate the products they needed through a broker or through some distributors or, or something of that manner. COVID overall was just a, a complete uh, and utter nightmare for about the first six months. And then we learned a lot of things. And, and I think what we're gonna see from that and really my optimistic piece of this is, is this new way of doing business. And, and I think we're gonna see that, uh, these new paradigms that are coming, whether that be through at-home work environments or whether that be through video calls or Zoom calls. But I really believe that uh, we, we as a culture are going to learn to do business in a different way. And I'm very excited about that.